me what is the reason that you're not allowing Eula Mae Powell's friend, Mary Diane Bukowski, in to visit her. I just came to visit. Why am I not being allowed in to visit? You tell me. Okay, Eula, you want to tell me what's going on? Tell me what's going on. By the way, this is being covered from my newspaper. This is press. This is, your, this is my newspaper. I'm a reporter. This will be, you all will be written up for what you are doing. No, no, because her guardian does not love her. Her guardian is robbing her entire estate. They did. Okay, I got you on. I got you on video. Tell me what else has been going on. Tell me. Tell me what else is going on, Eula. Tell, tell me what else they did. You said they ganged up on you? This lady is in her right mind. She has a right to have a visitor. Her guardian cannot bar her from having visitors. Does her guardian care about her? What has she done for her lately? Look, this, this is not necessary. You all have seen me here visiting before. I have never been a problem before. What is the issue? What is the issue? Well, I'll be getting my attorney and the paper's attorney to deal with this. Okay, you all need to call your attorney to find out what you legally can or can't do. You need to call your attorney because right now you're in the process of kidnapping somebody and holding her against her will. She, because she is in a nursing home does not mean she is under arrest. Eula Mae Powell is not under arrest. You are confining her against her will. You are preventing her from seeing her visitor, her lifelong friend of 40 years. You are preventing me from seeing her, from seeing you appal. Can I get your name, please, ma'am, the lady that's standing right here at the door? What is your name? You are even preventing her from talking to me. You all gave her a shot, evidently, that she did not authorize. Her doctor did not authorize. She takes medications. That shot could harm her. That shot could harm her. She's in danger right now. She is in danger. You do not care about her. You don't know. There is no, the guardian has no powers to stop someone from seeing visitors in a nursing home or to stop someone from associating with their friends. This lady has been my friend for 40 years and I know her inside and out. Her relatives have nothing more in mind than robbing her estate, taking all her money. She worked all her life. She worked for Dodge Main. She was an auto worker. She was a steward at the plant. She taught school. She has a master's degree in guidance and counseling. She has done many things throughout, throughout her life, and she's been an activist during all that time. And I'm an activist, and I will call out her activist friends to pick at this place. If you keep this up, this is an illegal detention. I didn't say I was coming out here to take her out of here. I said I was coming out here to visit. You hear me? I said I was coming out here to visit. 
Why can I not visit my friend? Why? You, t you show me something in writing that says I cannot visit, visit my friend of 40 years. You are not stopping me from this. And you will face the consequences. This nursing home will face the consequences. You've already been written up numerous times for violations of the state health code. I have all the records, 27 of them. This nursing home violates state law all the time. This nursing home is in violation of state law regarding how it treats its patients, how it treats its uh, how it deals with feeding them and other matters. There's all sorts of problems listed on the state website, which I have printed out and have available if you would like to see them. This nursing home needs to stop. You cannot just arbitrarily prevent somebody from visiting a woman who is in a perfectly sound state of mind. You could not do this. And I'm here to testify and witness to this, and there will be an article in my paper coming out about the policies of your nursing home, of your nursing home, stopping me from seeing my friend of 40 years. You're gonna stop me from seeing and visiting. I've been visiting here peacefully for months now. You've seen me before. You all have seen me before. So what's the problem? Have I created a disruption before? No. Even when I took Ms. Powell out to the store for an hour or so, nobody stopped us. I had her in a wheelchair. I, I rode her all the way down here in, front, in a wheelchair in front of everyone and Nobody stopped us. Nobody said anything that she could not go with me. Nobody stopped us. Not one of you all. You've seen me visiting this lady here before. Nobody stopped us. I have a right to visit my friend. You cannot tell me I cannot visit my friend. Hello. Yes, how are you? Good. What's going on? There, okay, let me speak to you first, and I'm actually a reporter too, so okay. I need to find out from you why they called you first. Uh, you're causing disturbance. No, I'm a friend of, they're causing the disturbance. They just gave this lady a shot that she didn't want. Okay. She's my friend of 40 years. I've been visiting her okay. regularly, peacefully. Okay. They've seen me here before. Okay. All of a sudden, they call me and tell me, that supposedly I'm not allowed to visit her anymore okay. with no reason. Okay. No reason. It's been peaceful visits. Okay. I've taken her out to the store one time okay. and I've known this lady for 40 years. Okay. She's an upstanding member of the community. Do, do you have any guardianship over her? Uh, I don't have. Her guardian has papers, okay. but her guardian has no right under state law to prevent her from seeing her friends, okay, but, to prevent her from visiting in the nursing home. Okay. I did not create this. Okay. They just, I was just peacefully coming out here to visit okay. and I was called by them and told that I could not come. And no. you I, I want to see my friend, I'm sorry. I want to see my friend. I want to see my friend. What are your names, officers? Sergeant Sikowski. Okay, and you, officer? Okay, no, you need to speak with me. You need to speak with me. This is outrageous. You're confining and kidnapping a lady that is only in here for her health. She is not under arrest. She is not prevented from visiting people. This is totally outrageous. They've seen me here before. I've been here before, been visiting regularly. I'm not signing her out. I came to visit her. I came to visit only. I'm not signing her out. 
Now, I have a right to visit. She has a right to get visitors. I'm not planning to take her any place. No, that won't happen until I make sure that she's okay, because I don't think she's okay right now. She was, she was given a shot against her will. She was given a shot against her will. Ma'am, okay, ma'am. Mm-hmm. This is their facility. They, they to, and they, that they, is they, a resident that is paying money to be here out of her estate, okay. which her relatives have hijacked. Okay, okay ma'am. Ma'am. Uh-huh. According to her guardian, they said that they don't want anybody else signing her out or her guardian. Did, so I'm not ma'am, signing her out. This is ma'am, ma'am. I came to visit her. Okay, ma'am. And they don't, they don't I, want to allow you entry right now. So why? They don't have to. This is a oh, why? What is the reason? They don't have Under to what reason. law? Under what law? You quote me the laws. You quote me the laws. Under what law? This is a private facility. Uh, they yes. don't have to grant you access to anything. A private facility getting public funding it from the insurance that these people have. That's what this is. A private matter. facility getting public funding and you're matter. and they're preventing me. I've been out here peacefully. No, at you least. have to leave. For what? They don't want you here. You're being advised on trespassing. You have to leave. I'm trespassing? Yes. I wasn't trespassing all the other times I you're, came here. Right now. I wasn't trespassing. There. Stop talking for a moment. Right okay. now you're being advised on trespassing. Okay? Mm -hmm. You have to leave the premises. They do not want you here. Okay, could you please say your name? Sergeant and Sikowski, Badge number, 19, please. Badge 19. And you also? Officer Robert Hill, badge 166. And what uh, police department Harper is that? Harper Woods Police Harper Department. Woods police department. Okay, ma'am. Okay. okay. Well, I am also a reporter, and okay. so you're violating freedom of the press right here. Okay. But you're mainly violating a friendship that I've had with this lady for 40 years. Yeah. I'm her best friend. Yeah, I've been yeah. coming here to visit her. Regardless, Peacefully. the business does not want you here. So oh, you uh, well, they're not going to have her here either because we're petitioning the court to get rid of that guardian. Okay, well, so I was bringing her that. papers to do that. Man, that's what, that's, and that's, that's what they're mad about. You're going to have to handle that to the court. Yes. Okay. Uh, well, that's what we're doing. Okay. This is a petition to the court. You're preventing me from talking to her about okay. it. You're gonna have it's to get already a drafted up. All right, well, go get your uh, We have a lawyer. And we will be in contact with the lawyer. Okay, and right. we will be suing this nursing home and the Harper Woods Police Department mm -hmm. for all your worth. Because this lady does not deserve this. After, she is 85 years old. Right. She spent her entire life working in the auto plant. She was a steward at Local 3 at Dodge, Maine. She, she has a master's in education. She has numerous other degrees. She has taught school in Highland Park in the adult uh, education for Detroit. Okay. She is an accomplished lady, and they are treating her like she's nothing. Okay, ma'am. They still ask me to leave. Can you leave, please? And if I don't leave, what will happen? Then we can, we can violate you for trespassing. They have asked you to leave. Well, they. what have they said? Does she want to see me? Ma'am, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. They okay. Leave, they don't want you on the premises. Okay. So let's go. I've been Please. on the premises. Let's make this easy. Let's make it easy, okay. Well, any final words before I sign off on this? No. No. So just tell me what you will do if I don't leave You'll right now. You'll be violated for trespassing. And what will that mean? You have to appear in court. Okay, will I get a ticket or are you going to arrest me? Well, you'll get it. You, you, we can't arrest you if that's what you want. No, I don't want to be arrested. You're okay, just going to well, give me a ticket? No, we could arrest oh, you. Oh, give me a ticket. I'd love to go to court. Well, you'll get that and be arrested, if that's what you want. I didn't say I wanted to be arrested we don't for coming to, out we to don't see my to dear arrest. friend of 40 we years. We don't want to arrest you. We just want you to leave. That's what we want. You okay, don't want just keep saying it. We keep saying this. Leave. This is going to our attorney. Okay, you can okay. say it to whoever you like. Mm -hmm. We just want you to leave. Mm -hmm. This is totally outrageous. Okay, let's go. Come on. Okay. All right.